and Rob Vivian's father tells me they rushed her here after the baby fell, and that's when doctors found an unknown condition. Tonight, he tells me while his little girl is strong, still, they're asking for your prayers. My daddy loves me. Through tears, a dad reads my to his baby girl tears. at her hospital bedside. My dad kisses me. A child so quiet and still, who just weeks ago had so much light in her eyes. This is Vivian Marisek, 11 months old and already in the fight of her life. I would give anything in the world to be in my daughter's place. Jake Marisek is Vivian's father. We asked him about Viv. He didn't want to be too far from her. So when a children's hospital and medical center spokesperson would quote, not facilitate an interview, Jake recorded answers on his cell phone. Please just keep her in your hearts and in your prayers. This is going to be a long journey. And prayers poured in around the Marisex neighborhood in the form of pink ribbons and hearts, Viv's favorite. Friends also made pink shirts that say, Go Vivi, go Vivi, go. I just started saying that one day when she was probably she was young and she started dancing. Now it's the chant that cheers her on. And when Jake is low on cheer, he writes letters on Viv's behalf. I will be one year old on the 21st. I don't know where I'll be at then. But Jake knows wherever she is. I'll always be here for you, Vivi. She will always be loved. I love you, Vivian. Now, yesterday, and forever. Love your daddy. Now Jake says the minute that they got, the minute that Vivian gets out of here, he's taking her on Disney Cruise. He says that is a promise that he made to her, but her condition changes every minute and every second, really. So it's unclear when that will be. Reporting live, Christina Engdahl, KETV News Watch Seven.